Wow, look at this. This is the best bit though. This is remarkable that these cotton reels are still in place. Look, the water is almost to the top of my wellies. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to today's video. So today we have had special permission given to us to go and explore an abandoned cotton mill. Now this mill has been empty for a number of years. We will put all the information that we can about the place in the description below. But right now we've got about a 10 or 15 minute walk along this path, which runs parallel with the river, or the stream which is down there. But our first location is down here. So let's go and check it out and see what incredible things have been left behind here. So these are some of the obstacles that we have to go through. This tree has come down and blocked the path. Oh, I think it's an American red oak. And they're pretty big trees. But it's not going to stop us. Oh, just about see the structure that we're going to, which is down there. So. We'll continue on this path as safely as possible and hopefully get to what we want to see. Oh, is she all right? <laughs> Lily's having a great time today. <laughs> okay, so we're getting closer to where we want to be now. See, there's a bit of a drop here, so we're going to have to keep on walking to it. Um, gets a little bit lower, but there's the building. Okay, so we're getting pretty close to the mill now. You can see the building just on the other side. Look how clear that water is. So cool. All right, let's go and see if we can find a way across. Okay, so we've made it this far, but I don't know if we're gonna be able to get across because this tree is normally how the local guys get across. And he told us earlier that he thinks it's gonna to be too slippery. So I'm looking at the water, but Tilly's just pointed out it is actually a lot deeper than what it looks. Because it's spring water, it's absolutely crystal clear. Oh God. I really don't want to fall in there. But I don't know, I, it, it might not be too bad there. Certainly here, it's about three or four feet deep. Well, I can only try, can't I? This is either going to end in disaster or I'm going to be really, really, really lucky. I mean, is that, that's not too bad. Whoa, it is. <laughs> oh, it literally went straight to my willy. Oh my God. Right, okay, I think 
I'm gonna have to commit to getting a wet foot. It's the only way I'm gonna get across. In fact, it's not too bad there. But I think the next couple of footsteps are gonna be fatal. <laughs> oh no. Ah, oh, okay, right, I've committed now. I've got wet socks. That water is absolutely freezing cold. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh God. <laughs> That's it. Oh, oh my God. Oh, it's making me go lightheaded. <laughs> oh. oh, God. Oh, I've got to empty my wellies. That is so cold. That is so cold. Oh, oh that's one. Oh, that's a horrible noise. Look at that. At least it's nice clean water. Poor toes. <laughs> Made it. <laughs> wow, look at this. This is so cool. Okay, so as safe as possible. We've made it. Just need to tread very carefully along here. There is actually like a little bridge which grows, goes across. I think it's made of flint. It should be pretty strong. Oh wow, look at this. This is absolutely amazing. And look, there's still cotton reels. In fact, there's loads. God, this is amazing. Wow. <laughs> Look at the old Castrol can as well. GTX. That was obviously for lubricating the machines. They've still got loads of stock in here as well. Look. I'm amazed it's still in the condition it's in, to be honest. I've got to be careful because the, the roof in this place is literally ready to fall down. So I'm not going to touch anything in here at all. Apart from the newspaper, which I've just noticed on here. Sunday Mirror, 1980. Wow. still in there like colours so you've got the blues the pinks I'm not sure what colour that was maybe green there's even more newspapers here to see if we can get a date on one of those oh there's the date there look to be so careful with it 1989 So I think the main cause of the damage to this place is this tree which is falling down and it's actually taken the roof out completely and the whole lot's just come down, sadly. And even the old machinery still, I mean this is so cool. Obviously I will get as much information as I can from the guy who actually let us come down here because this is on private property but he was kind enough to let us come down and have a look around. So I will get as much information as I can and put it in the description below for you guys. Look at this whole pot. I wonder what that dates back to. This 
This is so cool. Absolutely amazing. There's an old can up there. Mace. Not sure what that was. A little tin there, look. Players. <laughs> incredible, absolutely incredible. This is the best bit though. This is remarkable that these cotton reels are still in place. I mean, how many years have these been here for? God. And you look at this machine. George Hodgson Bradford. Look at that, it still turns as well. Goodness me. Okay guys, so I've just finished taking all my pictures. I'm gonna leave this building now, get back across the little stream where Tilly has been patiently waiting for me up there with Lily. And then we're gonna go and check out the other buildings at the top of the hill that we passed when we first came down here. Okay, so the bit I know you've all been waiting for is for me to get my feet wet again. Oh, God. Oh. Jesus, look how deep it is down there. Whew. Right. <laughs> I cannot remember which way I came. I mean, let's face it, whichever way I'm going, I'm going to get wet, so... Oh, God. I'm really not looking forward to <gasps> oh, oh. oh, bloody hell. Oh, it's bloody deeper here. God. Oh, oh God. That is so cold. Oh. Whew. Bearing in mind, it's like six degrees, whatever it is here today. Look, the water is almost to the top of my wellies. Oh, God. Whew, that's fun. Okay, now I've drained all the water at my wellies. Let's get back up to the beginning and go and check out the other buildings that are here. Okay, so we've made it to the next part of this location, which is gonna take us down this very steep path. We have to be careful because there's lots of flint around and obviously flint's very slippery. So there's a little ladder here as well. I don't know what that's for. Actually, it looks like it's been there for a while. made it. Wow. So this is another building which was part of the mill. I think this was a storage facility. Goodness me, look at that. Wow. Car's amazing. Oh wow, look at these. They look like they're old bedposts. I could be wrong, but that's what they look like. Really old, really, really old. Lily's having an absolutely brilliant time today. <laughs> she jumps like a deer, it's really funny. They were. I wonder if they were like old chimneys, possibly. So here's the second building. This one's quite big, to be fair. Ooh, fight me then, Tilly. 
She's throwing stones for Lillian. I wonder what it was. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh no, Lily. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing, you silly dog? <laughs> are you chasing stones? Look at your feet. They look so out of proportion now, don't they? <laughs> oh, funny. Okay, so while Lily is um, chasing stones in the freezing cold water, I'm just going to take a little walk along here because I noticed that there's another wheel. Do you know what? The windows on this place are really nice. Lily, what are you doing? <laughs> Tilly's laughing her head off up there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, oh, the water's getting really, really deep here again. I don't know how far I'm going to go, to be honest, in here. Um, it's quite unsafe. The chap told us to go around that way, and I just wanted to see if I can get through here, but I don't think I can. Because the water's too deep and it's bloody freezing. These buildings are so cool, they're so old. I mean, I saw a date on one of the wheels, 18, 1806, I think it was. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to have a quick wander up here and just see if it's possible to put my head inside one of those buildings. And I nearly went there. Did you see that? <laughs> I was kind of but laugh. <laughs> if something's telling me it's pretty good. And I'm not wrong. Wow. So I don't know where the front door is to this place. I need to be careful because there are some big drops either side of me. I think I've just found the door. Oh, goodness me, it is really bad in there. It's really bad. Oh, wow. Oh my God, it actually says museum there. Oh, wow. This is incredible, but it's also incredibly dangerous. Wow. It's a shame really, because this would have been a very interesting little place to have a wander around, but sadly, I think it's too dangerous for me to go any further. I don't think there's a lot holding that floor up and you can see there's some heavy iron work on there. And if that came on top of me, and it's not just that, it's right above the ceiling as well. You can see all those tiny, well, they look tiny, but they're not. They're all cast iron rollers, I believe, which were for the pulley system here. And if that came down on top of me, it's game over, which is a shame. But I've just noticed another door. Have a quick look inside that one. Let's see if it's possible to have a look in there. Sadly, again, I think it's going to be too dangerous. Oh, wow. Look at those. You can see the only thing that's stopping the floor coming down is the actual machinery inside this building. Oh, my God, they're massive. Wow. This is really cool. God. It's 
just a shame that it's so dangerous. I mean, I'm on concrete floor at the moment, but I don't know if you can see just down there, there's a basement with wooden floor. And if I was to step on that, God forbid, that would be very, very bad. Very interesting little place this. I had lots of fun here today. Right, time to go I think. Lily, what are you doing here sweetheart? Come on. Come on then. Right guys, we are going to make a move from this location now. Really hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. And please go and check out the Instagram which is the Beard Explorer underscore. And again, also go and check out the Facebook page because all the pictures I've taken from here today are put on that page. And we will see you on the next Explore scene.